This video is by Mark Kingston from the ARA Institute of Canterbury in Christchurch, New Zealand. Uh, I just want to do a short video on, a, on the cube root of a tank. So I used the figure before uh, in one other video of 2,600 litres in a tank. We needed to convert that to metres cubed. What we do, 2,600, divide it by 1,000 because there's 1,000 litres in a cubic uh, square metre. Uh, and that gives us 2.6 metres cubed, if you put that through the calculator, if that's what you need to do, which is fine. So over here we have 2.6 metres cubed. Now if we want to, what I've done in the previous videos, we worked out the height given that we had some information on the depth and the actual width. This time we want each length on the tank to be exactly the same. So on your calculator, You've got a um, square root uh, button on your calculator, but they also have a button for the cube root, and that has a little three in front of the square root symbol. So that's, uh, if you push that button, so what you want to do is you just want to type in on your calculator, use the cube root, 2.6, uh, that's a very rough six, but if that's what you do on your calculator, I've already done it, I know the figure, but I'll do it again. Uh, cube root of 2.6 and that gives me a length or a size of 1.375 and that's in meters so each face will be 1.375 so just to check it you should always go back through your numbers all you're going to do is 1.375 times 1.375 times 1.375 so you've got a meter here times a meter times a meter equals meters cubed if you put that through the calculator you will come back to 2.6 meters cubed so that's how you could get a cube root simply by using the um, cube root uh, function on your calculator I think you've got to push shift or inverse to to pick up that um, cube root function but that's how you can actually determine exact, exactly equal lengths on a tank if that's what you're trying to work out. Thank you.